Victoria Sarah from Babylon Pop TV, and we're here with Alex and Alan from These Kids Were Crowns. Hello. What's up, you guys? Uh, we are just here in... I'm Alan, and I like to party. <laughs> we are here in Milton, at the Milton Rocks. Festival. First year, right? Yes, I think yeah. so. It's a great, it's been great fun. The lineup is fantastic. We've had a pleasure of playing with many of these bands that we have tonight. Favorite Drive, Fifi Dobson. Jesse LaBelle. Sloan. Uh, Dave. David Usher. You never played with Sloan or David Usher. Right? Alyssa Reed. We just took the microphone right from. That's totally. Okay. My <laughs> DJ, DJ Maestro, and the radio stations like Z, Z, Z103.5. These kids were a crown. At Milton Rocks. You, what's up in Singapore? How was that? So Singapore was awesome. Uh, what do we do there? We played some music. We played a show with Simple Plan, which is a dream come true. There, awesome, awesome guys. We played uh, three shows for the Music Works Festival. Matters. Music Matters uh, conference actually. It's kind of a conference where like bands from all over the world. There's three from uh, or four from Canada. Sorry. Uh, Pavlo, very good guitarist, great guy. He's got a great looking wife too. Yes, they're both beautiful people. Uh, Simple Plan was there, and Saida, Baba. I can't remember her last name. Anyways, they're all fantastic artists, and uh, it was a great time. We had a lot of fun. Then we went to Australia. Yes, you did. And how was that? Good. Give me your best Australian accent. Yes, good. Good day, mate. Is that like Let's throw another shrimp on the barbie. No, <laughs> that was terrible. Okay. I had to get laughed at. But, Sorry? Okay, gum chewing in Singapore. Because we were talking about that. We were that. talking about that. And I, I yeah. told you it was not illegal, but I apparently don't they, don't, they don't sell it at stores. So you were correct. That. And, and I was wrong. Good thing I didn't start chewing gum. No, they would have arrested him, and you guys would have never seen him. So I played bass in these kids for about a year and a half, <laughs> and I am hoping to have only synth bass on this next record. That's what I've asked the guys. I, I don't like playing it really. What would you What would you do on stage then? What would you do on stage? Uh, would you just sit there. I'd choreograph some dance moves. Excellent. No, but seriously though. Even have cool dance. Synth. I think really synth. I'm not even joking right now. I freaking love synth bass, and I've got all these new soft synth programs in my uh, Pro Tools 9. We run your bass rig through a MIDI, and then it makes the same sound when you play it. There is such thing as a MIDI guitar, but I don't have one, and I know. That dude was playing it at the, remember, MMVAs last year or something? Like that. Oh, that's right, yeah, yeah, yeah. There's like MIDI guitar, and it's crazy. <laughs> We do a little sing off to see who who's is the better. Champion. Yes. What do you guys think? We can do a low comp. Ooh, baby, I love your ways every day. That's very nice. Ooh, I wanna be with you night and day. <laughs> <laughs> I almost forgot you the words. I think Alan wins. <laughs> we're not known for our talent. No. What we're known for is just getting sweat. <laughs> not even that either. Just getting sweaty and. Honestly though, that's we've talked about this before. Before shows, we always say positivity and creativity because that's what makes up for a lack of talent. Yeah. You guys get in a circle and do that, right? Yeah, we have our our. <laughs> you, you hold. Music comes down to good songs and and 
putting personality into it and having fun and that's what people love about the band. It's not they're not gonna come and be like, I just wanna like hear you sing a solo. It's like that's that's not what we do. There are people that do that that are awesome, but that's not what we do. And we're just I'll, I'll help you up. I'll help you up. I need in on this, okay? But but we just we know what we do and we love writing songs and that's our strength and then we love playing them together and that people like to see us having fun playing fun songs. Yeah, I'm going to change things up a little bit here. I want everybody to stand up and you guys are going to show me your favorite dance move. Oh, That's wow. a good idea. Yeah, let's go. Let's I do thought, it. Okay, okay, mine's sitting. Mine's a sitting. No, nope. oh, stand, stand up. Stand. Okay. stand up. It's upper body. <laughs> upper body. You just go like this. It's just like, like a little shoulder thing. Like you're embarrassed to dance a little bit. You're at a wedding and you don't move your feet. It's just like they're in cement. It's a confident dance, though. It's, yeah, it's like you don't need to use your delay. It's like, like you're thinking about something else, but the music's taking over you. I get it. And you got, oh, and you got to have one drink in one hand. Yeah. Jo Joey! Come here, give me a sec, give me a sec, come here. He's Joe's, so embarrassed. Joe, like, I can't do it, I do it, but Joe's dance move. Or even do it right there. Okay, so this is, this, this, this move right here. You're at a club. And and it's hot, yeah, yeah, do it. Do it. Joe. And it's hot. It's hot around you. You need to create some space. That's a little. That's called the the space creator. You got to create some space. <laughs> Ooh, it's a shame. 